Welcome to Quiplash. I'm Schmitty, your host, friend, co-worker, and father. Hey, welcome to the pizza party, you guys. There's no pizza. Oh, I wish I had given up pizza. This is round one. You get points based on the percentage of people who like your answer, and a bonus if you get more votes than your opponent. Go! sequel to Titanic if there were one. Titanic 2, blank. Okay, pick your favorite. Man is afraid of. <laughs> Vote on your devices. as a car decoration. is blank style pizza. for babies. It's 
That's round one. Let's take a look at the scores. Now round two, where all points and bonuses are double the drama. Okay, it's time for some quip lashing. First one, the worst album, Blank Sings the Blues. Coming up next, an item not found in Taylor Swift's purse. Next one, a good post music career for Justin Bieber. Vote on your devices. Next in line, life would be so much better if we all lived in blank. Next up, HR would probably get the most complaints on Bring Your Blank to Work Day. It's voting time.
That's the end of round two. Let's take a look at the scores. Things, but you can call me Schmitty. Also, you may call me Schmitty. Oh, I've got a good feeling about this. Sorry, I was talking to my tater tots again. Let's go! Time for round one. You'll score points based on the percentage of people who prefer your answer. Have at it! Here we go. Our first prompt is the worst thing you can tell the kids about the death of the family dog. Okay, everyone, vote for your favorite. completely untrue rumor about Alvin from Alvin and the Chipmunks. Time to vote.
Okay, next one. The best reason to go to Australia. Vote on your devices. That Barbie can be put in so many ways. Like a girl or a barbecue. So totally a Barbie. Name for a robot. Time to vote. Name of a dog food brand you probably should not buy. It's voting time. See, the score is... Round two is straight ahead, and that means all points are doubled. Show. Starting things off, a good way to get fired. Okay, voting time. Pick your favorite. Just typing something dirty. Time to vote. Coming up 
Next, a theme for a desk calendar that wouldn't sell very well. Vote on your devices. Okay, next one. Make up a word that means to make up a word. It's voting time. Invent a Christmas tradition sure to catch on. Time to vote. Round two is no more. Let's see the damage. This is round three, the last lash. One final chance to catch up. Point values are tripled, and everyone gets the same prop this time. Your last last prompt is... The most obnoxious name someone could give their kid. Everybody's in. Hand out your votes. That's the end. Let's see the final scoreboard.
Well, thank you very much, Thingy Song. Welcome to Quiplash. I'm Schmitty with an S. <laughs> hey, great job with those names. Hi, Larius. We are starting things off right. This is round one. You get points based on the percentage of people who like your answer, and a bonus if you get more votes than your opponent. Go! Okay, it's time for some quip lashing. First up, new sport idea, professional blank. Okay, pick your favorite. Next up, a lesser known ingredient in most microwave pizza pockets. It's voting time. And next, the worst name for a summer camp. Vote on your devices. The title you come up with if you were writing the Olympic theme song. Time to vote. Okay, next one. The worst advice your boxing coach could give you. It's voting time. Thank you. 
That's the end of round one. Let's take a look at the scores. It's now time for round two. Everything is worth double, twice as much. Take a look. Thanks for joining us. Starting things off, oh, invent a silly British term for pooping. Okay, everyone, vote for your favorites. Person to narrate the audiobook of Fifty Shades of Grey. Time to vote. Something that's made worse by adding cheese. Vote on your devices. A big hunk of cheese only makes constipation worse. How much worse depends on where you stick it. Next up, a new name for kumquats. It's voting time. Name for a racehorse. Time to vote. It's the end of round two. Let's see what happened.
Welcome to the last lash, the final round. Stakes are tripled. There's just one prompt, and you're all getting it. Our prompt is a surprising job entry on Abraham Lincoln's resume. You did. Apply, Apply your votes. It's over. Let's, Let's take, take a look at the, the final, final scores. scores. This is round one. You score based on the percentage of players who like your answer. Plus, there are winner's bonuses at stake. Go! First one, something inappropriate to do at the gym. Okay, voting time, pick your favorite. Yeah. 
coming up next. On your wedding night, it would be horrible to find out that the person you married is blank. It's voting time. A janitor or Sean Connery? If a winning coach gets Gatorade dumped on his head, what should get dumped on the losing coach? Vote on your devices. Vegas Casino, Blank Palace. Time to vote. Thing to yell as a baby is being born. It's voting time. That's all for round one. Here's the scoreboard. Round two time and to make it interesting, I'm doubling all the point values. You heard me. Okay, it's time for some quiplashing. The first prompt is a new ice cream flavor that no one would ever order. Okay, pick your favorite.
Next up, graffiti you might find in a kindergarten. Load on your devices. Next one, the worst way to spell Mississippi. Time to vote. Okay, next one. A great name to have on a fake ID. Vote on your devices. And next is an inventive way to get rid of head lice. It's voting time. Round two is now complete. Let's see who completed it well. This is round three, the last lash. Points are tripled and everyone gets the same one single prompt this time. The prompt is... George W. Bush and Dick Cheney's rap duo name. See the responses. Vote with your votes now.
That's it. Let's take a look at the final scores. Schmitty here. Welcome to Quiplash. Oh, this is going to be fun. And if it's not, it's your fault. Let's do it. <laughs> Time for round one. You'll score points based on the percentage of people who prefer your answer. Have at it. Let's start this show. Our first prompt is the old English term for vagina. Okay, everyone, vote for your favorite. And next, tip, never eat at a place called Kentucky Fried Blank. Time to vote. Next in line, the number one reason penguins can't fly. Vote on your devices. Next one, a surprising purchase on Willy Wonka's credit card statement. Time to vote. Next up, Kennedy's original speech said, ask not what your country can do for you, ask blank. It's voting time.
that's the end of round one. Let's take a look at the scores. On to round two, where all points are doubled. Doubled, I say. Take a look. Starting things off, the worst halftime show, The Blank Dancers. Okay, voting time. Pick your favorite. Coming up next, the worst way to remove pubic hair. Vote on your devices. Next up, something that would make an awful hat. Time to vote. Next is advice never stick your tongue into blank. Vote on your devices. And next, a gift nobody would want, the Blank of the Month Club. It's voting time. And that's all for round two. Fire up the scoreboard. <laughs> this is round three, the last lash. One final chance to catch up. Point values are tripled, and everyone gets the same prompt this time. 
last lash prompt is... Name your new haircutting establishment. to look. Give out your votes now. That's all. Now for the final scores. Hi, I'm Schmitty, which is Norwegian for bringer of quiplash. It's an amazing coincidence. Wow, there is a really weird energy in this room. Let's just try to get through this, okay? This is round one. You get points based on the percentage of people who like your answer, and a bonus if you get more votes than your opponent. Go! Okay, it's time for some quiplashing. First one. An odd casting choice would be Clint Eastwood as blank. Okay, pick your favorite.
Next in line, there is only one time that murder is acceptable, and that is when blank. Vote on your devices. Okay, next one. The best shirt to wear next to somebody who's wearing an I'm with stupid t-shirt. Time to vote. Next one, the seven deadly sins are lust, gluttony, greed, envy, pride, wrath, and sloth. The eighth deadly sin is, vote on your devices. Next in line, the worst job title that starts with assistant. It's voting time. Round one is in the books. Let's see the scores. <laughs> Time for round two, where everything is worth two times as much as that silly round one. Okay, here we go. First up, a real weirdo would fall asleep to the sounds of blank. Okay, everyone, vote for your favorite.
next is... Coming soon to a theater near you, Benedict Cumberbatch is blank. Vote on your devices. Coming up next, the worst word that can come before fart. Time to vote. Next up, what sperm yell as they swim? It's voting time! Okay, next one. Where do babies come from? Vote on your devices. That's the end of round two. Let's take a look at the scores. <laughs> Welcome to the last lash, the final round. Stakes are tripled. There's just one prompt, and you're all getting it. Our last lash prompt is... A bad name for an Italian restaurant. We're ready. Vote away.
It's over. Let's take a look at the final scores. My name is Schmitty, and I'll be your host today. We know you have many choices when it comes to games, and we're happy you chose Quiplash. Remember guys, during this game, it's natural to fall in love with me. Fight the feeling. Let's go. This is round one. You'll score points based on the percentage of people who prefer your answer. Have at it. Start the show. The first prompt is surprising first words for your baby to speak. Okay, pick your favorite. Next, a better name for France. It's voting time. Next in line, sometimes John Travolta wildly mispronounces names. How might he wildly mispronounce his own name? Time to vote. Come <laughs> on. 
And next is an alternate name for the Mona Lisa. Vote on your devices. Coming up next, you probably shouldn't hire a moving company called Blank. It's voting time. That's round one. Let's take a look at the scores. Mm -hmm. It's time for round two, where all point values are doubled. That's right, doubled. Okay, it's time for some quiplashing. First one. The title of a new YouTube cat video that's sure to go viral. Okay, voting time. Pick your favorite. Next up, you should never give alcohol to blank. Vote on your devices. Okay, next one. The most awesome Guinness World Record to break. Time to vote.
Next one. The worst thing to whisper during pillow talk. It's voting time. Okay, next one. How do you like it? Vote on your devices. Round two is no more. Let's see the damage. <laughs> and now round three, the last lash. Point values are tripled and you'll all be answering the same prompt this time. Your prompt is... Something Godzilla does when he's drunk. Okay, soak it in. Vote with your votes now. That's it. Let's take a look at the final scores. Welcome, Quiplash, Schmitty, host, enough with me jabbering, let's go! Well, I hope everyone took their shoes off, because this game has fairly new carpeting. 
Time for round one. You score based on the percentage of players who like your answer. Plus, there are winner's bonuses at stake. Go! Okay, here we go. Our first prompt is... New show idea, America's Next Top Blank. Okay, pick your favorite. Coming up next, brand name of a bottled water sold in the land of Oz. It's voting time. Next in line, the worst name for a tanning salon. Time to vote. And next, what bears dream about all winter. It's voting time. Next up, what your pancreas tests revealed. Vote on your devices.
that's the end of round one. Let's take a look at the scores. <laughs> On to round two, where all points are doubled. Doubled, I say. Take a look. Starting things off, bad advice for new graduates. Okay, everyone, vote for your favorite. Next is the name of the website that probably gave your computer a virus. Time to vote. Next, the best way to scare a burglar. It's voting time. Okay, next one. What really happens if you tear off that mattress tag? Vote on your devices. Next in line, a great brand name for extra, extra large condoms. Time to vote.
we've reached the end of round two. Let's see what happened. <laughs> Welcome to the last lash, the final round. Stakes are tripled. There's just one prompt, and you're all getting it. The prompt is... A reason to get into a fist fight with a koala bear. Take a look. Hand out your votes. That's the end. Let's see the final scoreboard.